episode of my restaurant here in Roblox. But guys, last episode, we finally had the ability with a brand new update to get celebrities into our restaurant. Uh, so much in fact that I built the entirety of floor four dedicated to this luxury style with like these luxury kind of tables and chairs or gold gold floor these jewelry cases with all the gems ruby gems in right now and it was pretty cool because it's, it's kind of like the shrine when a celebrity arrives all of a sudden a big horde of paparazzi follow and it brings you loads of people just like the shrine where you kind of activate it you get all those ghosts come in or Calls, we want to call them. You get the big dude coming too. You don't make as much money as the shrine, but it's still a pretty good thing. It's like having a boost and you didn't even enable it. It's pretty damn dope. So today then, guys, a few things I want to get set up and done. I want to try and create like a small little diner area, one of the new floors that I bought that I haven't done anything to just yet. And I want to finalize and finish up this golden kitchen. There's a little of a surprise that I've got that we'll add in a little bit later. So guys, if you are enjoying my restaurant, want to see more, then please make sure you smash that like button down below. If you are new in here, then make sure you subscribe so you know if I know that next episode comes out. But we're doing it, boys. We've got so many people arriving at the restaurant right now. We've got some sweet cash money moonlight to collect from the freaking money tree. And, uh... It's going to be pretty dope. Right. So what I'm going to do is jump to the store then. And we've already got three of the golden kind of stoves right now, which cost... 200,000 to buy. I need to buy three of the golden luxurious dishwashers. Luxurious and gold plated, cleans at a blazing speed and holds up to 35 dishes at once. That's a lot. So we're going to spend half of the money that we've got right now on three of those. Um, I've bought, this is a little secret, so I bought a bunch of these golden tip jars. Now, where do they go? Are the appliances? Yeah, I got five of them, so I'm hoping I can put one on each floor. And what those little tips do, oh, I keep pressing that wrong button, is they potentially, customers have a 50% chance to give us a tip when they finish eating. Now, you know that when you activate the shrine and the big spooky dude gives us like 50 Gs, what if he gave us a tip as well? I mean, that's going to be huge. That's going to be really huge. Uh, what else is over here that I could potentially buy? There's some nice better dishwashers over there. Oh, stainless steel counter. I might buy some of those to make the dining kitchen. We'll come back and check those out in just a moment. But, oh, butterflies here. Served a million customers. Oh my good God. That's a lot of paper, boys. That's a lot of paper. Right, let's get our luxurious golden kitchen area set up. So, dishwashers then. Right, how should I set this up? If I do one there one there and one there right and then we'll get the order stand right at the end just here and then we need some counters to kind of go around it to finish it all off then at some point i'll buy some more of these kind of vip tables and chairs as well that'll be kind of dope so i'm thinking what would go well Hmm, for tables and chairs, because I want it to seem like it's golden, like it's fancy. I don't actually think we have anything, any golden counters, do we? We don't, know. The closest we got to it is the standard wooden ones over here. So if I buy a couple of these, right, let's buy a couple. And I just want to see how they would look. I know there's more coming soon. They need to release like a golden counter set. That's what they kind of need to release in this game. Oh, it looks so good. I mean, I'm surprised they haven't, considering they got all the golden appliances and whatnot. So, furniture, these golden counters right now. So, if I um, turn that straight down to there, that straight down to there, and then just had the standard tables across, like that ish. I mean, just what it needs to do. It's not really that great. But we'll take it. We'll take it, boys. Now, where is my little tip jar? There we go. Can I pull it? I can't pull it on anything. But there we go. Drop a little tip there. That's going to be pretty cool, that is. That is going to be pretty cool. And we should add one of these to every floor that I currently have right now. So a nice little tip jar we'll put right there. Uh, the third floor, we'll pull it right there. Just before they leave the restaurant, hey? Uh, the fourth floor just there and i don't have anything on the fifth floor just yet because we've just recently purchased it and this is why i, I want to turn into our beautiful little diner so we've now just leveled up 
We can actually 2,250 in bank. Uh, one cook, one way out. We've got next. And I think we doesn't like some steak, which is $64. Oh, I keep pressing that button. No, I don't want to close the restaurant. I wish they redo the UI, because I think that is the close button to close this menu, and it's not. It's that button down there. How dare they? How dare they? Uh, right, okay. Looking good. Looking pretty good. So we need some chefs down here working away, but really, you're only getting kind of um, orders off these guys right now. But the golden kitchen is there when we need it. Right, decor then. Let's get all these little plants down them. We're gonna make it look super duper fancy. Get some little bamboo trees and whatnot. Let's get these nice blue ones all down. We're gonna make this place look more fancier than what it actually is. So we'll get some trees. Oh, I don't know if it's maybe I should put that one there. Let's get rid of that one for a second. A cactus there and one of those here. Oh, I like those little cypress plants. I didn't realize they were so big, but throwing all that in, it kind of hides the um the kitchen slightly through the plants so the people over here chilling they like oh i can i can see the chef fruit through the trees it feels like i'm in the amazon rainforest right now that's how it feels right bam wow it does it in literally less than two seconds cleaning up from the golden dishwashers that is ridiculous right boom i said boom there we go the money trees aren't ready for harvest i just harvest it boy right now we're gonna go buy some diner stuff. So another VIP has entered. So I wanna buy these little dining chairs here. We can create little mini booths. Now, I've been looking at them and I don't feel like to create a booth, it's gonna work with the table that it says. Ooh, we're completing all the, all the little quests right now. Damn, why damn. Right, how much furniture have I just bought there? I got 39. Right, we'll get 50 of these chairs. Or at least as close as. Um, drape table. See, I don't feel like that goes well with creating a booth. This table here goes really well with it. Or even this luxury table as well. See what I mean? That also goes just as well. But I think I'm going to go for this one because it, it gets rid of the... Uh, you don't really have that golden kind of leg. So it doesn't add too much to it. It doesn't take too much away from the design that I'm trying to kind of go with as well. So we'll buy those to kind of to, to kind of like begin with it. Let's get back in. I think once I got more tables and chairs, then we'll activate the shrine and get all those spooky dooky peeps in right now. So the next floor, then we'll start creating little booths. And I think I'll do it like this, like right there. There we go, little diner booths, which I think look really cool. And we can kind of go a little bit further with this now because of how a booth normally works. There we go. How far can I take this? Oh, so it just leaves one left. I think we'll stop here then. We'll stop there. And I think then we'll go this way down. How many tables and chairs have I got? Still got quite a few. There we go. Some there. Leaves there. So we'll stop at this point as well. Get to there. They're both in. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. This look really good, this is. I mean, okay, I've still got a few tables and chairs remaining. So we've created our little corner section there for the diner. And then we keep coming out of this way. So two there. So now we're kind of starting to get our little pattern together. And we're going to try and maximize this as much as possible. We need so many more tables and chairs to get going. Right, there we go. How has that one just misplaced itself? Get out of here, boy. I ain't playing these games. You boy ain't playing these games. Right, that's all my tables. Um, tables, sorry. Chairs now gone. So, completed a special service there. Ooh. Your boy is killing it right now. And um, so before I would like on the other floors, I've always put like the, um, what do you call it? The the kitchen. I almost struggled to think while it was then for a second in the center of the room. But I want to go for a diner style, meaning having it to the side. And I think I'm going to use this side over here as the kitchen. And we're going to use those red counters as well, which I think will look really, really nice. I've got one more table, which... 
Do I finish it up right against there or here? Let's just finish it here. So that's all my tables, gun, and my chairs. Need to buy some more to kind of get all that finalized. So let's get back down there again. So we might as well start buying all the kitchen stuff as well. Right, there we go then. So how much have I got remaining right now? Ooh, I've still got plenty of money. So I don't think we're going to run out anytime soon while we do this little build. So keep buying a bunch of chairs right now. And I might fight, finish it up as well and put the diner booths against the kitchen area. That could be pretty cool. So I'm going to have to buy a little bit extra chairs right now. Okay, we'll go to that. Uh, right, let's buy a bunch of these. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Didn't we have some on sale over there? There is. Let me buy a couple of corners right now. We have a couple over here. Well, some over here on sale. I, I completely forgot about that. Which that will save me a little bit. How much, how much is on sale? 15%. Okay, we'll, we'll take that. We'll take that right now. And we'll come back for the the appliances. Because I'm still trying to kind of design it all nice. Oh, wait. I didn't buy the... um tables snap Seniac run you folio right, let's buy a couple of tables again not too sure how many tables I need so I'm just gonna buy a bunch of them there we go I've got 18 should be enough right whatever I don't use you can now sell so that's kind of a good thing as well right customers are coming in left right and center that's what I like to see next floor and let's start with let's finish up the tables then first there we go. Get these little... I don't know how it placed that one there. We will never know. There we go. Delete. Noise. It looks really good, doesn't it? We get so many customers up here. So many. Uh, right, so if I had the stainless counter... There. Because you need a space gap for the thingy. Or do I put it on this side? See, there's more rooms to do on this side here. So I think we're going to have it here. So I run the counter up to there. And... Right, because you need space for the order section, don't you? Alright, run it up. I'm hoping it will work. It should do. It should work. I'm hoping it will. Because it'll be a nice... A nice little design. Right, appliances. Oh, we're going to get the tip jar down. Of course we do. Tip's just there. Nice. And do I have many tables and chairs remaining right now? So I could... Do I do it like this way? Leave a bit of a gap there. There we go. See how far these tables allow us to go? And then just at this point there, we'll just kind of maximize it all. Sweet, right? So then we just need the dishwashers and the kitchen area. And it's very simple, very basic dining. It's like, like a cafeteria canteen style, this is. Which it does work to a certain degree. And when we now activate the powers within the shrine, it should be good to go. Are right, they still coming in thick and fast? Has my boost stopped right now? I've still... Oh, i got 50 seconds after my boost. So I get as many people in as possible with this boost. Keep accepting them. Right, I'm just spamming E as they enter. Just get in, boys. we got room for everybody right now. We have room for everybody. Just keep getting in, boys. How much left in my boost right now? There's 30-odd seconds. I've still got low. The, the cooking the stoves faster. I've still got plenty of time left on that. But this boost is going to end, so I'm maximizing it. 20 seconds remaining. So as many people that I'm bringing in, there's also the same amount of people walking out of the restaurant because they've been served, they've eaten, and now they're going home. So it's a never-ending circle that we kind of got right now. There is like a little never-ending circle. Nine seconds remaining. Oh, boys, we're so close. So close right now. Three, two, one, and boom. There we go. My little boost is now over. So let's activate the shrine. Are you ready? Oh, has he got a new little thing on top of it? Oh, there we go. Are you ready for the rumbling? Here we go, boys. 
the rumble in the jungle. Nice. Which is, uh, you know, going to bring so many more customers in. So while we wait for that to happen, let me go spend some money then on the appliances. So, ooh, the mysterious energy is here. Right, why don't I go for these 90,000 ones or these? Let's go for the 90,000 ones. Let's buy three of them. Let's buy three of them. I won't buy the golden ones there. We're reserving them for the VIP section. Oh, wait, I need a um, an order counter. I need another one of those. Where are those again? Here. Ha! Oh, we only need one. We only need one, boy. All right, let's run back. All right, the ghosts are here, boys. They just walk in. They don't even care about anybody right now. They have no for for anybody. So let's get... Oh, that actually, sit, yeah, that actually works. I didn't think that was going to work. So, stoves, high-tech stoves. There we go. Let me get dish... Oh, the, the, the question mark dude has entered. Dishwashers are down. And then we'll get the order stand just at the very end there. Keep it nice and simple and basic. So, I wonder where that dude is going to sit. Let's start on the first floor. He's not down here. They're only reserved for um, VIPs anyway. Uh, floor two, is he up here? Can't see him on floor two. Floor three. Can't see him on. Oh no, I do, I do, I do, I do. He's over here. There he is. There he is, boys. A 50G freaking sale we're gonna now make, which gives us a lot of money in the bank, boys. I'm hoping he leaves a tip. Uh, I've just spotted somebody over here leave a tip. Can we see if anybody else leaves a tip? Anybody else want to leave your boy a tip? Twelve dollars, six dollars, eight dollars. Yeah, yeah. We actually get quite a bit of money from tips. I didn't realize how much you kind of get. Right, they have the orders should now be taken, and they should be cooking those orders, those delicious orders up right now. I'm waiting for him to start eating. Is that the is that his food over there? Oh no, 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 it's not. It's the dude next to him. Has he has he placed an order? Yeah, what has he got? He has got... Today, he has the fish. Delish. Delish, delish. He has the fish. All, right, all their orders have been taken right now. Oh, I didn't get that bit down there, did I? Decor. Completely forgot about that. There we go. Got the blue flooring down. So now it's the calm before the storm as we wait for him to finish his delicious meal and for your boy to make 50,000 big ones. And hopefully he leaves a tip. Do you know how cool it would be to see if he leaves a tip or not? So I want to keep my eye on him. Right. He got the food first. So technically he should finish first. Yeah, he does. I'll wait for the waiters to kind of grab. Oh, there we go. 50,000. Bam. So I wonder if when he walks out, he will leave a tip or not. As celebrities just entered as well, so we get even more paparazzi coming in. Another boost. Yeah, boy. He was happy. He enjoyed the fish. He did enjoy the fish. Now, do these guys leave a tip? They do leave a tip. Right. I have a feeling he's not going to leave one. I just have that feeling he's not going to leave one. Is he? Nah, mate. He ain't leaving any tips, is he? The only tip he's leaving is, yo, Senia, I can take an umbrella when it rains. That's my tip for you right there. Damn, Fulio. Maybe we should move the tip jar to over here. That might be a good chance, to be honest with you. But still, though, 50,000 big ones in the bank. Right, where is this celebrity then? I, I don't think... Is that him there? They look quite celebrity. I don't think you know what the celebrity looks like, do you? They could be anyone. It could be this person over here with the blue hair. They look quite celebrity. You never know. You just never know in this game. Uh, right. Fifth floor. Oh, this diner. It looks a bit funky, this diner, but it does work. It does technically work. Well, it ain't too shabby, is it? It ain't too shabby. But we do need some more decorations up here. We do need some more decor up here right now. So, floor one. Let me get out of here right now. His floors aren't working for me. I want to show you my family. What family is that? You look quite weird and scary to me. Oh, money tree. Yeah, yeah. Um, right. 
who is on this? How many people are serving right there? Ooh, we're clearing close to 5,000, which is really good. Let me check out this. Um, so the highest level on the server is level 20. Damn, I'm only 11. I'm only 11 right now. Uh, who's got the bigger, biggest restaurant on here? Ooh, ooh damn, boy. Is it between these two dudes over here? Yeah. 7,000 people served. Oh, they've got a nice little diner section going on down here right now. Very basic, but it is pretty cool. Should we zoom out and see anything magical going down on those floors? Nothing that's going to take my breath away. No. Uh, how many people have they served? 11,000. Right? They've served a lot more. They've got more of a grinding setup right now. Oh, I like what they've done here with the uh, stuff in the count in the counters section. And um, yeah, all the food is in one place as well. Is that a better system to go with? Like turning one floor maybe into the whole kitchen system? Maybe. Who knows? All right, we teleport back anyway. Your boy has got 360,000 in the bank right now. It ain't too shabby. And I think for now, guys, we're going to end it for here. If you did enjoy another episode of my restaurant and want to see more, then please make sure you smash that like button down below. If you aren't new in here, make sure you subscribe. And until next time, boys, I'll see you all soon. So good. Uh, bye.